Also, it's been really awesome. So, back here again for another video. Now, today we got a video uploaded by Cosmic Wonder. This one's called Doctor Strange Multiverse Madness Trailer News, Spider Man's second trailer, and Agatha Harkness spinoff. That being said, we're going to get into it. That Before we do that, y'all got to let me know that. that ah, let me know down below in the comments, man. How was your day? Hopefully, it was pretty good. If it wasn't, hopefully, this makes it just a little bit better. Now, I'm saying, let's see what Warren has to say. Let's get him in. Let's go. How's it going, everybody? It's Warren. Welcome back to the Cosmic Wonder, where we talk all things Marvel and MCU. And today we have yes. some pretty exciting news that I think fans are going to be really happy to hear. We're going to be talking all about right. Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. When to expect that trailer? There's some returning so much to be expected some new characters, in this movie. And of course, Spider-Man No Way Home. We're all waiting for that second trailer for yes. Spider-Man No Way Home and the first trailer for Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, because no doubt the two of them are connected since the films are connected themselves the trailers kind of have to cooperate with each other because yeah. no doubt the first doctor strange in the multiverse of madness trailer is going to basically feed off of what we know from spider-man no way home since he's going to be one of the main characters of that film and that's when the multiverse is truly going to burst into madness but we'll talk about it all in this video Can't wait. if you're new be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of the latest mcu videos if notification now, bell madness subscribe right now has a lot of hype around it now spider-man oh, yeah. no way home probably has more hype but i don't think people are ready for what we're about to see in multiverse of madness i think this mirrored this is how everyone's talking about this movie all the stuff that's been rumored to go on in this movie it's just so much as like how can it possibly live up to the hype you know what i'm saying it's kind of like that almost avengers endgame moment except it's not exactly that but it's like even crazier in a sense you know what i'm saying if even half of the leaks that we've heard so far are it's true, true it's going to bro. be absolutely insane right from wanda slash the scarlet witch from ultron bots to america chavez to the illuminati to the x-men possibly showing up Dude. it's all absolutely insane and we'll talk about that in just a bit but first let's talk about when to expect the first trailer for Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness and the second trailer for Spider-Man No Way Home. Now, the Spider-Man No Way Home second trailer right now is rumored for November. This right. would put it about a month before the actual release of the movie, which you could definitely argue is too late. Usually, they release the full trailers months before the actual movie really? comes out, months? not just one month uh, before it comes that out. Makes sense. But if they are trying to keep a certain surprise a secret until right before the movie comes out, aka Tobey Maguire Spider-Man man and andrew garfield spider-man showing up and you I do mean, plan to show them in a trailer before they actually make their appearance in a movie then it would make sense that you would show them right before the movie that was a little creepy <laughs> that way, right before the movie, the hype is absolutely insane. The opening box office numbers can crush every record there Dude, is. I'm and then saying. you can do some TV spots too, giving I'm us saying. a little bit more footage of the other two Spider-Men as well. Now, Daniel RPK came out today talking about the Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness trailer. And he says that he hears that the Doctor Strange 2 trailer is going to be coming out in December. Now, Daniel Richard has sense. a very, makes very a good sense. track record with trailer release dates. Speaking specifically about release dates i don't think he's ever really been wrong so i would expect the trailer to be so he's got some credibility also not to mention the movie is coming out on march 25th in 2022 and if they do release the trailer in december that's only three months before the movie releases depending right. on the actual release date but as i mentioned in the beginning of the video dr strange in the multiverse of madness is kind of going off of what happens in spider-man no way home as well as some other things like wandavision loki and perhaps maybe even a part of what if but bottom yeah. line is doctor strange is in spider-man no way home and this takes place right before multiverse of madness so right now the doctor strange 2 trailer is supposed to be in december and spider-man releases in december as well so if i had to guess i would probably say that we're going to get the doctor strange 2 trailer right. after the release of spider-man no way home. right right as a release in the theaters more in the teaser trailer that about makes what's sense really going to be happening in doctor strange in the multiverse of madness because we would have already seen no way home if they right. released a trailer before before, then they run the risk of possibly spoiling something that happens in the movie and they're not going to do that so either it's going to be like Smart. a big teaser trailer meaning they're really really going to tease us and not give us that much yeah. or it'll be a somewhat revealing teaser trailer like they did with spider-man no way home showing all of the villains yeah. because i definitely was not expecting to see any nope. multiversal <laughs> villains in the very first
first teaser trailer for Spider-Man No Way Home, but hey, we got it. And I'm hoping yeah. we see some pretty cool reveals in the Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness trailer as well, which means they should show a Spider-Man before, meaning the trailer's probably going to come out late December, which is fine by me because we have plenty of Spider-Man No Way Home stuff to talk about before then right. to keep us occupied. And Hawkeye's coming out as well, and not oh, to yeah. mention we are getting that. more and more information about Multiverse of Madness in the meantime. Like Every today, day. we have some pretty big news about Agatha Harkness. Two pieces of big news, actually. One relating to Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness and one relating to her own Disney Plus series that what? is reportedly being developed right now. Agatha first, Harkness before we Disney see her Plus in her series? own Disney Plus spinoff, she is going to be reappearing in the MCU in the Multiverse of Madness, which I think a lot of us probably expected considering yeah. the fact that Wanda is such a huge character and is going to have some of the spotlight in Multiverse of Madness, which is okay because Benedict Cumberbatch is going to have some of the spotlight in Spider-Man No Way Home. And again, I think this That's movie fair. is going to be a lot bigger <laughs> than a fair. lot of us really realize. For example, like I mentioned in the beginning, there are reports that we are going to be seeing some Ultron bots in Multiverse of Madness. There have also been some reports that we're going to be seeing some X-Men show. If, 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 if they do talk about or even reference the whole Ultron thing and they get the voice, it has to be James Spader's voice. It has to be. I, I, I'm sorry, but it has to be, bro. Please, James Spader. Just lend us your voice for like five lines, five, six lines, man. Come on, man. Show up as a part of the Illuminati, specifically Professor Xavier. Now, there's been a rumor that Wanda is going to end up killing Professor Xavier, a rumor that I hope is not true. Oh, wait a minute. I, I, didn't, I knew they were going to fight, but, but it's not, not true that what? He dies. And we just saw Ultron take over multiple different universes, destroying multiple different Die? universes in What If. Now, plenty of people at Marvel nah, Studios have confirmed not. that What If is canon to the MCU. And that may not mean anything right now, but the other day, the Direct.com reported that there will be some Ultron bots in Multiverse of Madness. Does this mean that Ultron could return? If What If showed us anything, they showed us that anything, anything is possible with the multiverse, and that is exactly what Doctor yeah. Strange is going to explore. So if there are some Ultron bots in Multiverse of Madness, I'm going to assume that there is indeed another Ultron out there somewhere, meaning he could return. But there's actually a little bit of a twist in these Ultron bots appearing in Multiverse of Madness. We have a leaked photo that is not confirmed to be real or fake at this point, but the leaked photo does show two Ultron bots and and Professor Xavier. The Ultron bots are actually holding Doctor Strange. And Strange mm -hmm. is actually in some type of handcuffs. But here's where it gets really, really interesting. It looks like the Ultron bots are presenting Doctor Strange to Whoa, Professor Xavier. What? And next to Professor Xavier, Who's that? it looks like it's Wong. Now, I'm showing parts of this photo because if it's real, I don't want to be showing the whole entire thing. Not trying to get no my channel taken way. down. But if this photo is real, this is quite the scene no. that we are going to be. No. No way. Yo, that's crazy. Dude, I'm just, I, honestly, I, I don't even know. It's like, I just, I just want to see it, man. I just want to see it, Marvel. Let me in. You can, Marvel, you can, like, email me some, or, or send me an invoice of some, I don't know, some secrets, man. Like, what's going on with this movie, bro? I'm just, I'm just so curious and intrigued by everything that's just to be said around this movie. I'm just... I just, I, I don't know, bro. This is crazy. Who, who does Professor X think he is, man? Like, he just has the Sorcerer Supreme in handcuffs. <laughs> You've seen it. As you can see here, this is Patrick Stewart's Professor right. Xavier. It looks now, like if it. this is indeed real, that probably means that the Illuminati report is also real. The Illuminati in the Multiverse of Madness is not going to be the typical Illuminati from the comics. It's going to be more of a multiversal Illuminati. Pretty right. much what we just saw in What If. A Will we see Black Bolt? I doubt it. Is responsible for protecting I, the multiverse. I really want to see a good version of Black Bolt. Not the crap they gave us in and it looks like that Professor inhuman Xavier show. is going to be one of those people and probably the leader. This could actually be Professor X trying to recruit Doctor Strange. And hmm. since Professor X has psychic abilities, he can control the Ultron bots with his mind. How they managed to capture Strange? Not sure about that. Maybe he's right? weak after his events of No Way Home. But he does have Wong oh. beside him. So perhaps Wong actually knew about the Illuminati beforehand. Maybe Wong is a part of the Illuminati himself. And Maybe Doctor Strange Wong is kind of paying for things Illuminati? that he did in No Way in Home. After all, he did kind of 
kind of mentioned that his spell goes wrong because Peter tampers with it. And we know the yeah. multiverse is going to be in madness in Doctor Strange 2, and perhaps that is due to Doctor Strange, and perhaps the Illuminati have a big problem with that. And that could be why Doctor Strange is in handcuffs and is facing Professor Xavier, who could Yo, be the leader of the Illuminati. So right now, none of this is confirmed because it is not confirmed if this photo is real or not. But if it is, and all of this does actually happen in Multiverse of Madness, we are going to get our minds blown. And I really think the upcoming Marvel movies, The Eternals, Spider-Man No Way Home, Multiverse of Madness, Thor Love and Thunder, all of the movies coming up are truly going to be huge. But yeah. in the meantime, let nah. me know what you all think about this in the comments down below. Let me know how much you would freak out if Professor Xavier, A lot. Patrick Stewart's <laughs> Professor Xavier, showed up in Multiverse of Madness. Don't forget to hit that like button, and for live updates, you can always follow me on Instagram and Twitter. And as always, thank you all so much for watching. Wolf, Wolf. 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 All right, man. Caught Warren. Ah, I said Warren. Warren has said it here, man. Apparently. Multiverse of Madness trailer to be expected in late December. As you know, I kind of expected Spider-Man 2 trailer. I heard like a while back that he said, yeah, looking around November, potentially. That makes sense. You know what I'm saying? I get the heart in a spinoff. Interesting. A lot of people kind of, yeah, did enjoy her character and stuff. But she, I don't know. Is she like a really, is it going to be really interesting? I don't know. Maybe if they do her well in Multiverse of Madness. But do you think as a character, she could hold her on like a little show or something? I don't know. I'd, be, I'd still check it out as Marvel regardless, but you know what I'm saying? I don't know. Also, the whole Professor X leader of the Illuminati, bro. That's crazy. That'd be really, really cool to see, though. But I, I want to see their roster. Hopefully, their roster is not like characters we already know. Unless it's like what if characters. I, I still want to see like other characters we may not like. Like, I, I, I said a Black Bolt earlier, and I doubt it, but, like, you know what I'm saying? I want to see, like, characters we don't really know too much about, but, like, fans would know. You know what I'm saying? You don't even have to explain them, really. Because think about it, Not everyone. A lot of people have, but not everyone's seen the old X-Men series. You know what I'm saying? So, people, some people won't get the whole, like, Professor X thing from the old X-Men movies. Some people won't understand that. You know what I'm saying? So, I think they could put other characters in there. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Y'all let me know down below in the comments, man. What are y'all thoughts on this? What are you looking forward to most? Doctor Strange? Spider-Man. As of right now, I'm going to have to say Spider-Man. But Multiverse of Madness is actually, uh, well, to be honest, it's actually about even. Spider-Man because Spider-Man is my favorite character. But Multiverse of Madness, is a lot going on in that movie. And it's so much I'm hearing. It's like, I don't know how it's going to live up to it. Anyways, y'all let me know down below in the comments, man, what y'all thought. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitch. Follow me on YouTube. You can also follow me on Instagram. We are Seso. Same as YouTube channel. That being said, peace.